medical professionals say even those that don't have flu-like symptoms still feel the need to quarantine themselves. But staffers with LifeServe Blood Center in Sioux City say they encourage the opposite from those with a clean bill of health. KTIV's Libby Randall talked to those staffers and got more on what they advise potential blood donors to do during this time. She joins us in the studio with more. Libby. That's right. I spoke with Community Relations Coordinator Claire DeRoyne about any changes LifeShare has made to their donor requirements. She said that not much has changed. They maintain various cleaning routines to equipment, furniture, and other surfaces and items donors come in contact with. They have made a few changes, but most of those come with a potential donor questionnaire. The LifeServe Blood Center is asking blood donors if they have traveled to China, Iran, or Italy in the last 14 days or been in contact with someone who has. There are also donors who have been in contact with someone who has had the coronavirus in the last 14 days must refrain from giving blood for 28 days. We pretty much would defer anyone who may have had any chance of coming in contact with this. And then beyond that, we have screening that we do on the blood donations themselves. We run 15 individual tests on each and every single blood donation. So safety is our top priority. Keeping the blood supply strong is our top priority. Deroyne also said Life Serve Blood Center urges healthy donors who have not been to China or had contact with someone who has in the past 14 days to schedule appointments and continue donating. Stella. Thank you very much, Libby. If there is the possibility you could have been exposed to the virus, the Iowa Department of Public Health suggests self-isolating for 14 days 